All right, and we are back, guys. Welcome to the outsourcing module. And in this module, we're going to be talking about how you can take Social Media Massacre and literally take all of the work out of it. Set this up so that you can hire employees for pennies to do all of the work for you. So I'm really excited to have you guys here today. This is one of the most important and powerful modules out there. Um, and, and this is not only something that will help you with Social Media Massacre, but something that will help train you for setting up a really profitable and successful online business. As I was always told uh, by my mentor, being an entrepreneur is not about being a lone wolf or a one-man army or a one-woman army, <laughs> but it's about having employees and being able to do many things at once. And that's what outsourcing will really allow you to do. So before I take up your, your whole time here on this first slide, let's go ahead and move on and get started. So what are we going to cover? Now the first thing we're going to talk about is what outsourcing is and why it's helpful. I'm also going to cover how to find your own employees, how to train your employees, how to manage your employees, and how much to pay your employees. Most people have the misconception that outsourcing is something that would require you to pay somebody $8 an hour or minimum wage or um, a lot of money. When in fact, outsourcing is something that many um, large American corporations have been doing for nearly uh, 20 or 30 years now, moving out to uh, companies where labor is much cheaper and where the U.S. dollar is worth far more there than it is here. Um, so, you I mean, you'll see many times, as I'll say in this presentation, um, one to four dollars an hour is not unheard of. In fact, I've actually had an employee for a dollar an hour. Um, but they were in the Philippines, where that $1 an hour is the equivalent of $6 an hour. So, uh, you know, once again, that's very, very fair pay, for, especially for what they were doing. So what is outsourcing and why is it helpful? Well, first thing I want to say is that social media massacre can get a bit tedious. But then again, just about anything online can get tedious. And this is especially true when you're trying to tackle everything by yourself. I see many people that are trying to be one-man armies and not really branching out their business into a real profitable model. Um, you know, understanding that you can't do it all by yourself. That's just simply a, a very important business mechanic, a very, very important part of being an entrepreneur. Um, and how many businesses do you know that are a one-man army? My point is that very few businesses can be run alone. Um, I actually only know probably one or two people that make over $50,000 a year that are able to run a business by themselves, and both of them are in the lawn care business. So, um, you know, it's, it's very rare that you're, you'll be able to actually do everything by yourself. And even if you were able to, why would you want to? It's, it's really stressful. It's, it's really not worth it. So outsourcing will allow you to inexpensively hire employees to do your work for you and help you run your business. So you're probably wondering, how do I find employees? Uh, the first thing you're going to need to do is to search Google for outsourcing sites. Now, I have also provided a list of very, very powerful, very cheap outsourcing sites ready to go that have come with this module. So be sure to check that out. But you're looking for people that are qualified to do data entry. Now data entry, for those of you who don't know what it is, it's literally as simple as it sounds. All they're doing is either clicking on something or they're going to be inputting information. It's as basic as it gets. But you also want to make sure that your employees speak proper English. Uh, it's going to be very important when they're making their own tweets and Facebook posts that they are spelling everything properly because if you're misspelling stuff and it just it looks really bad people are not going to click on that at all so you want to make sure that they do have the ability to speak proper english so try searching for sites that target countries like india and the philippines the philippines i've always liked because um, english has been a very it's it's a very easy language um, to find employees for in that country uh, many many Filipinos actually have the ability to pick up English as a second language so uh, it's it's much uh, easier to find somebody that, that speaks proper English in the Philippines than it is in India 
However, in India, it's still very possible. So both of those countries are, are very good. Uh, but you can hire anybody from around the world as long as they obviously speak proper English. Um, they're a hard worker. They're qualified for data entry. Um, it really, it really simply doesn't matter. So that's the great thing about outsourcing. But you're going to want to check for reviews on whoever you're thinking about hiring. You want to make sure that you check them out before you invest in them. Not only for, you know, getting your money's worth, but also to avoid any potential problems. Um, the outsourcing market has unfortunately been targeted by a lot of scammers. Um, being able to get into email address accounts, uh, get into your contact lists, um, that's stuff that can get you into a lot of trouble. So you want to be very, very careful in how you do this. And I always recommend that you schedule a Skype call or a real phone call to see if they're interested. Uh, people tend to be um, really hesitant to talk on a Skype call or on the phone if they're hiding something. So that, that is able to help me out a lot. So I really recommend that you guys check that out. So how do you train your employees? Uh, basically, all you're going to want to do, it's very, very straightforward. You're going to want to obviously learn Social Media massacre, massacre yourself. I'm sorry, I can't talk today. And then you're going to want to teach it to them. I, I'm completely fine if you guys want to go ahead and send them the video and show them, um, you know, let them see how I do it so that they can really absorb the material and really be able to do the job properly for you. Um, once again, I have no problem if you send that to your employees. Um, just make sure that you once again meet up with them on Skype or you have a, you know, you exchange a conversation to actually see it that they know the method. And I recommend that you have them do a sample run for free to show you that they know what they're doing before you start paying them. Uh, but be, be patient with them when they're starting. Everybody takes time to learn. I mean, when I first um, picked up the social media master style method, uh, it took me, I would say, probably about two months before I was able to really get traffic from it. Um, but, however, you know, obviously with my training and um, my the way that I've structured my video, you know, it's, it's easy to get up and running much sooner than that. But you're always going to want to make sure that you know what you're talking about before you try to teach somebody else. So, how do I manage my employees? You're going to want to request to meet with your employees about once per week via Skype to go over results. Um, you can communicate by email, but I, like I said, I always like to talk about things on Skype. It's much easier to see if somebody's doing something they shouldn't when they're actually talking to you um, than you know, by, by email. And I also recommend that you track your traffic results with Google Analytics to make sure that the employee is not only doing the work for you but is also just the right fit so how much do I pay my employees well you're gonna to want to structure it between one to four dollars per hour uh, to be really fair um, and it may be boring but it's very very easy work I mean one to four dollars an hour in many other countries is the equivalent of five six it can be as much as ten dollars an hour um, so, you know, definitely don't feel bad by paying somebody a dollar per hour. Uh, understand that the conversion rates for currency are, are insane in other countries. So, um, you know, once again, you're not taking advantage of anybody. You're not doing any, anything wrong. You know, it's 100% fine. So, this is a very important one. When should I start seeing results? This depends on a few things. But most importantly, it's going to depend on how well you've mastered the original Social Media Massacre yourself before you've trained your employees. Now, like I said earlier, you're welcome to send them the original video, but I recommend that you kind of coach them on the method so that you can start getting traffic, you can start getting results much, much more quickly than just handing them the video and letting them go to work. Uh, you're just gonna be paying for somebody, somebody for something that they're really not gonna be able to give you your money's worth for so you know I, I really uh, recommend that you spend quality time with the original product first get it working for yourself and then start to hire the employees and just stick with it and be patient with your employees if they aren't doing quality work after one week you may need to search for somebody else 
Um, I mean, I would even say less time than that. Uh, three to four days is really enough time to see how well somebody's going to work for you as well as how well um, that particular um, style of outsourcing is going to work for you. So what are some other ways to outsource Social Media Massacre? Well, there are two tools that I use that are incredibly powerful, guys. The first of which is Fiverr. And Fiverr is hands down one of the best ways to quickly outsource the process of building AdMe Fast Points, as well as other social exchange points, all without having to hire any employees or manage anybody or pay anybody at a custom rate. Fiverr is definitely one of the best. Another great one is SEO Clerks, and this is a very powerful one as well. Starting at just $5, you can get as much as 40 to 50,000 AdMe Fast Points which is incredible considering that I believe 1,000 points at this time is $10. So you guys are definitely going to want to check out these two um, for really knocking the socks off of this method without having to fool with other traditional outsourcing methods. You guys are also going to want to check out the success tools that I've included with this pack. They're definitely going to reduce the amount of time that you have to spend doing outsourcing. Um, I have some ready-to-use email swipes that I've sent, as well as, like I said earlier, a list, a huge list, of very popular um, outsourcing websites that are particularly powerful and cheap to use. And as a bonus, I've included some extra lessons on outsourcing and how to work it into your internet marketing business for maximum profitability. Outsourcing is a very, very important part of being an entrepreneur online, and I really, really commend you guys for investing in this module. This is not only something that will change the way that you use Social Media Massacre, but just how successful you will be online. So once again, guys, thanks a lot for joining me for this success training module, and I will see you soon. Take care, guys.